back to school You've made it through the summer Now there's work to do So put a smile on your face And sing out with me We're gonna have a good year Just wait and see We're gonna have a good year It's true Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi ta'ala wa barakatuh This is teacher How far to feel Dear pupils Welcome again In a new lesson So Today's lesson is about uh, chronology and discourse markers. So, in this lesson, we are going to learn the meaning of chronology, discourse markers, and of course, we have some tasks for you to do at home. Thank you very much. Let's go to start our lesson. All right now, so we shall start our lesson. First, we shall deal with discourse markers. Now, let's see chronology and its meaning. It's like an introduction. So, what do we mean by chronology? To organize a series or a sequence of events, actions, or activities as they actually occurred or happened in time. I can use the following chronological markers first, then, next, after that, finally. So, this is a very short introduction so we can understand the meaning of chronology. Now, let's move. The linking words now, or let's say chronological markers, both of them are correct. So, let's see the meaning of linking words. We use linking words first, next, then, and finally to describe the order in which two or more actions happen. Very good. So, we use these linking words in order to link actions together. Not only actions, also we can say we can link words so they can be in a chronological order. Now, for more explanations, for more examples, let's see this. We have the first linking mark, which is first, next, then, finally. Now, one by one, Let's explain these linking words. We start with first. Now, we use first for an action that happens before any others. We can also use first at the end of the sentence. For example, as you say, first, let's see the museum. Or first, let's take the flight. Very good. Next, can be used for an action that happens after another action. For example, we go to the museum. Next, let's see, for example, the Big Bang, right? Or uh, uh, let's go to the hotel next. We move to the museum something like that very good then for an action that happens after another action if it's not immediate for example let's go to the airport let's go to the airport then we take the flight to Paris very good finally for the action that happens at the end after any others or after a long time as you say we went to the museum then we have seen some mm, adorable landscapes finally we went to the lake very good let's move
now it's time okay now let's see some practical tasks so we understand what have been said before let's start the task together Nadia, welcome back Nabila. How was your cruise? Nabila, nice to see you all again. Oh, it was wonderful. I sailed from Algiers to Spain on a cruise ship. I visited Italy and I sailed to Istanbul with a stopover for two nights on the Greek island of Mykonos. I returned to Algiers after having spent four exciting days in Turkey. Very good. So, this is a dialogue between Nadia and Nabila. They are talking about a trip or a vacation. And as you see here, you have some numbers number one, two, three, four. So, as it was mentioned in the question, we are going to fill in the gaps with linking words. We are going to link these actions together so they can be in a coherent order we have number one two three four so and they gave the linking words of course uh, like uh, first finally after that next so I give you at least uh, let's say two minutes to think about the task and we shall come back again see you all right so we're back again after two minutes i hope you did the task now let's see the correct answers first uh, i give hints all right so these are the answers gap number one first gap number two then gap number three after that and gap number four is finally you just need to follow the, the arrows so in gap number one we used first in gap number two we used the linking word then in gap number three we used the linking word after that and in gap number four we used the linking word finally now let's check our 
dialogue all right Nadia welcome back Nabila how was your cruise Nabila nice to see you all again oh it was wonderful first I sailed from Algiers to Spain on a cruise ship then I visited Italy and after that I sailed to Istanbul with a stopover for two nights on the Greek island of Mykonos. Finally, I returned to Algiers after having spent four exciting days in Turkey. Very good. I Okay now, so let's see the sentences. Sentence number one is, I went to London. Very good. Sentence number two, I visited the museum. Okay, next. I took some photos. Excellent. Next one. I had my dinner. Good. There is a missing I here. Sorry. I had my dinner. It's a mistyping. And I spent my last night. The last sentence. I took my flight back home. So, we have these sentences. We are going to join all these sentences using our discourse markers or our linking words so we can get a coherent paragraph it's very easy uh, the linking words that I gave in the question uh, they are finally after that then next now I shall give you some time to think about the task. I hope you do it. See you after two minutes. So let's see the answers now. We join the following sentences together using 
the link in marks let's start first seeing the first sentence and the second sentence when I join the following two sentences the answer is I went to London first I visited the museum all right sentence number two then I took some photos next I had my dinner after that I spent my last night finally I took my flight back home Welcome back to school You've made it through the summer Now there's work to do So put a smile on your face And sing out with me We're gonna have a good year Just wait and see We're gonna have a good year It's true شكرا على المشاهدة لا تنسوا الاشتراك في القناة الضغط على الجرس الإعجاب بالفيديو